you'll ever just sit outside on a cold day and go, because you can, <laughs> I do. I'm gonna go make coffee out of this snow. I'm gonna get the cleanest snow I can. And I'm gonna friggin', oh crap, it's got like snow on the steps. I'm gonna get the cleanest snow I can and I'm gonna use this to make my coffee. I'm gonna boil this snow and make coffee with it. Look at this. This never happens. Oh man, this looks good right here. This snow is the spot. I see. Yep, this, this is it. Oh, it's cold. I gotta do this quick. Oh, look at that. Wow. Ha. Ah, holy crap, this is cold. Okay, full disclosure, this is awesome. Snow coffee for life. Do you see all this? Like, look at, oh, you don't get that in Texas. Hot crap, this is a red letter day, man. <laughs> I, have, I have a deep love for coffee. And a lot of my friends can't drink coffee. And so, you know, I'll, I'll try to make them coffee that they like, but you know, nine times out of 10, it just doesn't work because they aren't used to the bitterness of coffee. A lot of people will say, I can't drink black coffee. And well, I couldn't either for a long time, but uh, how I got into drinking black coffee was, you know, I just put a bunch of sugar and creamer in it and then I ran out. And so I tried honey and then I ran out. And by that point I was kind of used to the bitterness of it. But I also had a, a type of coffee that wasn't so bitter. It was, it, it was an Ethiopian blend. So it's a lot more fruity and floral-y of a flavor. Now, when I say that, don't think that this is gonna taste like strawberries, because it won't. It'll taste like coffee, but it'll be a lighter, more palatable blend of coffee. But uh, yeah, after, after just drinking so much with sugar and creamer and then weaning off to honey, you just get used to the taste. And yes, I know that this has sugar and creamer in it. I put it in there. It's a type of drink called a Corbano. The coffee shop near me makes it and it's just phenomenal. It's it's like Cuban style espresso with, uh, you know, milk like a Cortado. And so you mix the sugar in and then the coffee with it and then the milk and you get this. And yeah, it's sweeter. You still get the bitterness of the coffee in there though, which the contrast between the sweet and the savory is really nice. So cheers to you and happy snow coffee day. Well, I'll see y'all next time. <laughs> I'm a dragon.